vehicle and the tank missiles equipped on top Russian attack helicopters are considered extremely dangerous weapons. They can easily destroy even the most modern tanks in the world. This is a supersonic missile with a powerful warhead like any other Russian anti-tank missile such as Kornet, Fagot, and Conqueror's M. The Russian Defense Ministry on June 6 reported that the Russian military destroyed 28 Ukrainian tanks in the southern region of Donetsk, including eight German-made Leopard 2 tanks. The ministry later posted a video showing the Russian military destroying Ukrainian combat vehicles, including Leopard tanks. According to experts, the video shows that the vehicle air launch missile system was used to paralyze enemy armor. The Nike 121 vehicle, NATO designation 8016 Scallion, is classified as a Russian laser guided anti tank missile. Vehicle was developed by the famous weapons manufacturer Klashnikov in the Soviet Union in the 1980s to equip the Ka 52 Alligator attack helicopter. At that time, the threat posed by advanced Western manned battle tanks equipped with explosive reactive armor and composite armor necessitated a new type of anti-tank missile to replace the Nike 114 Saturn system. The vehicle has been in mass production since 1985 and has been in limited service with the Russian Air Force since 1990s. The missile can be launched from warships, Ka-50 and Ka-52 helicopters and the Su-25T aircraft. It was first shown publicly at the 1992 Farnborough Air Show. The vehicle missile is tasked with hitting maneuverable ground targets protected with reactive armor. Additionally, it can also engage medium-speed airborne targets such as helicopters, attack aircraft, and drones. Vehicle is compatible with APU-6 and APU-8 air launchers, of which the APU-6 can carry six missiles and is used on the Ka-50, Ka-52 helicopters while the APQ-8 can carry eight missiles and is on the Su-25T attack aircraft. The vehicle has a maximum range of up to 10 kilometers, which narrows down to 5 to 6 kilometers at night. Its tandem high explosive anti-tank warhead can penetrate explosive reactive armor. Vehicle is claimed to penetrate up to 1,000 mm of steel armor behind explosive reactive armor. The missile detonates upon contact when aimed at armor targets. An additional feature is its proximity fuse, which enables area effect. This versatility allows the missile to also target non armor targets, infantry, and helicopters, that's often being referred as a multi-purpose missile. The laser-guided vehicle follows a laser beam directed at the target. It incorporates an automatic size unit equipped with TV and infrared channels. Both target tracking and missile control are automated. The missile traveling at supersonic speeds can be launched individually or in pairs against the same target. The vehicle missile boasts a hit probability of up to 95% against stationary targets and up to 80% against moving targets. However, it is important to note that this missile's accuracy diminishes over long ranges due to the spread of the guiding laser beam. 
The vehicle is significantly cheaper than the US Hellfire, which is similar in function. Its price is around $28,300 per missile, opposed to $111,000 per HGM-114L Hellfire missile. In early 2021, Klasnikov Corporation completed tests of the improved Vicar 1 missile. A KA-52 helicopter fired 22 Vicar 1 missiles during tests at the Russian Defense Ministry's test range. The upgrade has increased the short-range strike capability and increased the missile's flight stability. The Vicar missile is currently one of the munitions deployed on the KA-52 attack helicopter. The newly upgraded Vicar 1 variant will become part of the armament of Mi-28N attack helicopter. According to experts, Vicar is one of the most effective anti-tank weapons in the world.